Welcome to Crema Media's Resources Watch, a weekly video roundup of the events and people making and shaping the news in the mining industry. This week, a billion rand cash burn at Amplatz's loss-making mine. And Kumba Iron Ore feels the tailwind of a two-year wage agreement. Anglo-American Platinum suffered a 1 billion rand negative cash outflow at its loss-making Rustenburg Platinum mine in the six months to June 30, while its union section, which is the other part of its restructure request that has led to the prolonged consultations with government and labor, burnt 350 million rand in the same period. Martin, the increase in, in net debt position is actually pretty close to what we'd expected. So there's nothing untoward about the amount of cash that we are burning. And we understood that, uh, that in particular from the Rustenburg operations in the first half of this year, that the Rustenburg operations in their current form would keep on uh, reducing, would, would reduce the amount of, of cash coming into the company and, the, and increase the cash going out. So we understood this. We're at about the same levels that we had expected. And, uh, and, but the need, and what it does do is it actually emphasizes the need for us to continue with our portfolio restructuring. So if anything else, it just means that we have to be, we have to be resolute in executing what we had designed earlier. Iron ore miner Kumba Iron Ore is feeling the tailwind of its two-year wage agreement, which means it won't have to negotiate remuneration at a time when the employee relations in the mining sector remain difficult. When we were speaking six months ago, all I was talking about was people being on strike and so forth. So I'm really pleased that uh, this six months has gone as well as it has. In an environment when uh, labor relations are really quite difficult in, in, in our industry, so the two-year wage agreement uh, started in July last year and lasts for two years. And in the middle of it, i.e. July this year, we have an increase of between 8 and 10 percent. So I'm hoping that we can have an increase without anybody having to fight for it. So I, th I think it's fantastic and I'm very pleased to be in this position. For mining news as it breaks, stay logged on to miningweekly.com and register for our free daily newsletter.